Hello, T. Oh, something's wrong with your headset. With your earphones, can you fix the wire, please? Okay. Yes, okay, I can hear you now. So, good evening, T. Good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. How about you? I'm fine, too. So, have you finished eating your dinner now? Yes. What's your food for tonight? It's a tomato, cucumber, soup, fish, and dry. Wow, that's so delicious. Okay. Yes. So, did you eat a lot? Yes. Okay, very good. All right, so for tonight, T. Oh, wait a minute. I will check if I gave you a homework. Did I give you a homework last time? What homework? Okay, no homework. Yes, we don't have... I didn't give you homework because teacher was off for... Um, the Filipino teachers are off during that time. Okay, wait for me, T. All right, so for tonight, we are going to have some activities for you to do, okay? Okay. Okay, wait for me because my table is so okay. All right, so let's begin our first activity for tonight. All right, so for tonight, we are having speaking activity. So in this activity, T, we are going to practice our speaking skills, okay? Okay. Okay, very good. All right, so look at the picture, T. Now I want you to identify or tell me the differences that you can see. Okay. Mm, um... This is a girl and this is a boy. All right, one point. Uh, this is a red helicopter and this is a yellow helicopter. Very good, two points. Mm. A man in the helicopter uh this is wear a hat and this is not yes it, ha it has no hat three points very good mm. um this is a plan and this is a bird Yes, very good. Four points. Mm. This is three cloud and this is two cloud. Very good. That's five points. Okay, so can you see anything else? And I don't know. That's all? Mm. Okay, so now let's check your answers, T. So you were able to give five differences in this picture. So now let's see. All right, so here are some suggestions, okay? The helicopter is red, but the helicopter is yellow. So one point, two and three clouds, correct? Two points. Man with and without hat, three points. There's a frog and a bird, four points. Next one is girl, boy playing with the kite. Very good, T. So a total of five points for you in the first part. Very good. Okay, let's put five points here. 
So next one, okay? So teacher will be asking you some questions, okay? And practice, okay. you practice answering in a complete sentence, just like before, okay? Okay. Number one, where do you go at the weekend? Um, I go to the beach. And you go to the beach? Mm-hmm. And I eat in a restaurant. And you eat where? In my friend's home. Ah, in your friend's house. Okay. So who do you go there with? It's my father, mother, and my sister. Oh, your family. It means your, your family went... Uh, you went there with your family, right? Yes. Okay, next one. Where do you like going in the holidays? Mm, I like in a park. Oh, you like going into the park? Why? Why do you want to go there? Um, Because I can play... A badminton, football, eat ice cream, walking, mm -hmm. and I and have a uh, many chair in near a uh, near river. Ah, okay. So there is a river near the park. Yes. Oh, very good. That's nice. So I think the you have a fresh air in the park because there's a river near it, right? Yes. Okay, so you like going in, in the park on holidays because as you say, you can ride the bike, play badminton, eat ice cream, play football, and you can play with your friends there. Very good. Okay, so now T, I want you to tell me something about your school uh, what okay. can you say about your school my school have a two floor mm -hmm. and three stairs it has a 20, um, 22 class oh ah, very good have a one two three four five and what five it is oh, what's that one two three four five what is it is uh in a window ah window okay and half a um, one one a big door going in the school. Ah, there's a big door going inside the school. Yes. Um, have a room of the teacher. A uh, library. Mm -hmm. um, Okay, so there's a library. There's uh, do you have a clinic also? Mm, can you speak again? Do you have a clinic also in your school? Mm, I don't know. A clinic, this is a place where you can go to when you're not feeling well. There's a nurse and a doctor in the in your school. Yes, ah, okay. um, have uh, one doctor. Ah, okay, you have one doctor. And then, um, do you have a canteen also? Mm. And... In the... And then, uh, what and... are... Okay. We Are you have, continuing? Um, 
many tree in the school. Oh, you have many tree in school. Okay, now yes. see. Um, what food can we see in your school? Can you speak again? What are the food that we can buy in your school? Um, is a milk, a milk, mm -hmm. a chicken, fish, mm, broccoli, carpets, cucumber, um, cake, many fruit. Mm. And drink. Okay. All right. Wait a minute, P. Teacher will just drink a water, okay? Okay. Wait for me. All right, T. Okay, now let's have the next question. Where do you go at the weekend? So as you can see, there's a picture of having a picnic and going to the zoo, okay? Okay. Okay, now T, I want to know. Um, do you also eat um, in the park and have picnic with your family? Yes. Okay. So when you're having a picnic, what are the foods that you bring? I eat, I drink uh, milk, orange juice, um, a dish, and lemonade. Okay. So who prepares the food when you're go, you, when you go to the picnic? Who prepares the food? It's my mother. Ah, very good, your mom. Okay. So 
How about going to the zoo? Do your family also go to the zoo? I don't go to the zoo. Because? Because my country don't have a zoo. Really? But in the uh, near city is uh, um, Hoi An City has a big zoo and uh, I mm -hmm. go to the zoo in two. How many zoo does Vietnam have? I don't know. Okay, wait a minute. What is the name of your place? Is uh, Nui Thai. Nui Thai. Nui Thai. Yes. Wait a minute. Zoo in Nui Thai, Vietnam. Okay, wait a minute. I will just look. Vietnam. Okay. Oh. There are some zoos only in Vietnam. There is one in Dai Nam Zoo, which is in Bing Duong. There's a zoo in uh, Tu Le Park in Hanoi. Also, there's a zoo called Saigon Zoo and Botanical Garden in Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam. Okay, wait a minute. Also, there is Vita Garden Mini Zoo in Bintuan Province. Our next one is Bin Pearl Zoo in Kien, yes. Kien Jiang. Yes. Uh, so what zoo did you visit already? What's the name? It's, uh, it's on the Hoi An. In Hoi. the Hoi An. In the Hoi An. Wait a minute. I will look for it. Hoi An. And oh. Oh, what else? I don't I don't know a uh, name. I don't know the name. Okay. Well, there are some mm, there are some zoos, big zoos in Vietnam, okay? How about in Dong Tam Snake Farm? Mm, I don't know. Okay. Well, this is nice because we have here some zoos. Okay. All right. So when you go to the zoo, Viet um, see what do you go? What do you do there in the zoo? I see the animal. You see the animals. Very good. Okay, so I have a question for you, T. Do you have any picnic? Yes. Who do you go there with? With my family. Okay, so where do you usually go? It's a park. At the park, okay. Next one. Which animal do you like the best in the zoo? It's a... Uh... Is the giraffe. Ah, oh, you like the giraffe. Okay, why yes. do you like giraffe? Because giraffe is tall, yellow, half a, and the giraffe is um, the face giraffe is so cute. It's so cute, the face of the giraffe. Yes, because the giraffe is a very big animal. It's very tall. Its body is very big, but its head is just small, right? Yes. Okay. Next one. Okay, as you can see, we have here four pictures. Now, see, I want you to tell a story out of the four pictures here. Okay, start with picture one. Um, a mother is make a dinner. A boy, a her her boy her son is playing a car, two car, and a daughter is 
um, is um, is high in the tree. Yes. Okay. What else? Um, two is a uh, a mother is go um uh, in how a girl is climbing in the chair and and holding fruit yes it's food. holding a food okay and then and children children running mm -hmm. then she eats the food but the mother um when the boy eat mm -hmm. mm, and i don't know okay let's see all right so here in picture number one so the mother and the and the son is in the backyard um for snacks for eating some snacks right and then yes. there is a girl hidden um hidden what they call this one behind the tree so in picture number two the mom was going inside the kitchen again to get some food. Now, the boy is still playing under the table. So the girl got a slice of the cake and ran away. So in picture number three, okay, so the girl ran away. And then, well, in picture number four, the, ma the mother went out again from the kitchen and she asked the boy, where is the slice of the cake? So, as you can see, there is the girl still hiding behind the tree with the cake. Okay, so very good, see? All right, so now let's find the different ones. Okay, number one, which one is different and why? Um, it's a book. It's a book. Okay, why book? Because the book is a school thing, but the lemon the pineapple and the orange is a fruit. Very good. Number two is the spider. All right. Spider. Why do you say so? Because spider is a insect. Okay. Because the spider is an insect. While mm. Mm. and also it's color black. While the other things are red okay number three is uh the gun is riding a high okay the girl is riding a horse okay why is it different because this picture don't have water okay because it doesn't have a water and number four is a rabbit. Oh, a rabbit. Okay. Why do you say it's a rabbit? Because the rabbit is under the table. Very good. Because it's under the table. Okay. Next one. Oh, we're finished. So let's open the next part. Wait for me, T. All right, wait a minute. Where is it? Okay. All right, so this one is about outdoor activities. Okay, now T, let's answer activity number one at the beach. So let's 
um, you have to read the story, T, and choose the missing words here from the red. Okay, wait a minute. From the red words, okay? So start reading now. Okay. At the beach, we, uh, we like going to the beach. We go to the beach in the summer. We mm, we see no as uh, we call as we no um where yes as we shoot. We go into the water. The water is away. Cold and night. Then we building sand castle together. We sit under the umbrella. We eat ice cream too. It is a way fun at the beach. Okay, very good. It's always fun at the beach. All right, T. So how about you? Do you like going to the beach too? Yes. Uh, why do you like going to the beach? I building a sand castle, swimming, um, and eat some ice cream. And eat some ice cream. Okay, very good. All right. So we have here some questions, T. Say if it's yes or no. Do they go to the beach in the winter? Is no. No. Next one. Do they wear swimsuits at the beach? Yes. Yes. Do, do they play with sand? Yes. Yes, of course. Very good. Okay. When you go to the beach, do you also like playing with the sand? Yes. Oh, why? Why do you like playing with sand? Because I can build many things. Yes, because you can build many things like castle. All right, so let's have some vocabulary words right here. Okay, what can you say about picture number one? Up is swim. All right, let's see. So very good. Picture one is swim. Okay, let's talk about swim. Do you know how to swim, T? Yes, but my sister don't know swim. Ah, oh, your sister doesn't know how to swim. All right, so yes. where, where do you want to swim? Do you want to swim in the swimming pool or in the beach? Um, I like swimming pool and a big too. Ah, oh, you like both. Why do you like both? Why do you like to swim in both places? Mm, because uh, my sister can swim in the pool. Uh, because your sister can swim in the pool. Okay, so yes. next one. Is, um, uh, next one is collect shells. Okay, next one is collect shells. Okay, so when you are on the beach, T, do you like collecting shells too? Yes. And then what do you do with the shells? I holding them um, in the house and, mm -hmm. and I... Mm. Oh, you bring you bring the shells at the house. Yes. And then, do you play with them? Yes, I play with my sister. And then you play with your sister. Okay. Now, how about go walking? So when you're at the beach, tea, or or maybe in some places, do you like walking too? Yes. Oh, why? Why do you like walking? Because it's having to the body. It's healthy to the body. Very good. Because walking is a good exercise too. 
Okay, next one, please. All right, here are some words. All right, what can you say in picture one? That is? Is a body shoes. Body surf. Body surf. All right, so body surf. This one is a kind of water sport where you have to play with the waves, okay? This is quite dangerous and only professional surfers do this one, okay? Okay. So how about you? Do you know also how to body surf? I don't know. Yes, because that is because... for very dangerous um, activity at the sea. Yes. Okay. Um... Wait a minute. So, T, how do you pronounce body surf in Vietnamese? Can you read that one? Lướt sóng không có vá lướt. Again, again, again. Lướt sóng không có vá lướt. Okay, very good. That's very nice to hear. The teacher cannot say it one more time. Okay, next word is? It's catch crabs. Catch crabs. Okay, so catch crabs. All right, usually we can do this one in the sea because there's no crabs in the swimming pool. Okay. Yes. Do you eat crabs? Um, yes. Okay, very good. Because teacher doesn't eat crabs because I have allergies to uh, for eating crabs. Is that your father? No, it's my grandfather. Ah, it's your grandfather. So how do you say grandfather in Vietnam in Vietnamese? It's um ow. Um ow. Yes. Okay. In Philippines, we call grandfather Lolo. Lolo. Yeah, in the Philippines we call grandfather Lolo, but in Vietnam we you call them ow. Yes. Okay. How about grandmother? How do you call them? Is a uh, ba. Again? Ba. Ba. Yes. Okay. So now let's go to the next one. T. Build a sand castle. All right. Well, this is very um fun thing to do at the beach, right? Because you can play with lots of Sand. Okay, so do you know how to build a sand castle? Yes, my father um, this me. Ah, your father teach you how to be, build a sand castle. Okay, yes. very good. Okay, next next one. Oh, what's the word? Uh, surf. 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 All right, so surf, this is again a kind of activity. A water activity that you must play with the waves. Okay, this is very dangerous. Okay, so do you know somebody in your family who knows how to surf? No. Uh, why not? Because my family don't don't have a surf. Ah, don't know how to surf. Okay, next one is play with. A beach ball. Okay, play with a beach ball. And last one is? Is paint. Paint, okay. So some people, they want to go to the beach to paint or to draw because they just sit at the sand and look at the surrounding or the beautiful view that they can see and then they will start to draw and paint. Okay, next one, T. Oh, what is it? It's flying a kite. Mm -hmm. Fly a kite. Do you know how to fly a kite? Yes. Oh, very good. So where do you usually fly your kite? It has a wing. Okay, where? Where do you play your kite? A, a park, a beach, and... Um, my school. Ah, very good. You can play a kite in the park, in the beach, most especially, and in school. Okay, very good. Okay, next one is? Is jog. Oh, no, no, no. The second one. Get? 
Yes, a suntan. Yes, get a suntan. So that means that you must um you must stay under the sun so that your skin will be color brown or tan. Okay. Okay. Because some people wanted their skin to be color tan like that on the picture. Oh, they just lie down on the beach and there's the sun and yeah, their skin will be color brown already. Okay, next one is? A jog. Jog. Okay, jog means running. All right, so where do you think is the best place for jogging? Um, is a uh, street. In the street. Okay, why do you say in the street? Because the street is long. The street and is we long. can jog. Yes, very good. The street is long and there is no... Um, and, the, and the surface of the street is, um, what they call this one, is smooth. It's smooth, right? Yes. Okay, very good. Next one, T. Is play beach volleyball. All right, play beach volleyball. So this is a very common or a very famous kind of game on the beach. Okay, beach volleyball. Okay, because... Um, yeah, the space, the space near the sand is very wide. So it's very nice to play volleyball. Do you know how to play volleyball, T? I don't know. Uh, yeah, because it, it is very, your arm will be hurt when you play volleyball. Yes. Okay, next one is? Is riding a bike. Yes, ride the bike. So this one is a very fun thing to do. It's a good exercise for your legs. All right. Now, do you know how to ride the bike also? Yes. Uh, which, which place do you think is the best place for biking? Um, is in a street, a park, um, and I go to school in the bike. Oh, really? You go to school by bike? Yes, I can go to school in my bike, but um, the streets have a um, half bike. Yeah, it's traffic. It has a lot of cars, right? Yes. Okay, so you must just bike at the park because the, the park is a very safe place to bike. All right. So now, T, okay, for your homework, I want you to um, prepare a picture. Do you have a picture of yourself in the beach? Mm, a picture in the beach? Yes. Do you have a picture of you and your family at the beach? Yes. Okay, now that will be your homework, okay? Prepare okay. a picture of your family at the beach, okay? And then after that, you're going to tell me a story about the picture, okay? Okay. All right. So that's all for tonight, T. See you again on Thursday. See you again. All right. Chukungon. Chukungon.